Yo, what's up, you guys? So, obviously, South Elite Team Season is now out. Some pretty good looking cards. Um, though we have Team Season to Reddit. I haven't seen the card yet, but from what I do know, he isn't the quickest striker. I've been doing Team League predictions, and I don't think, I think he's like one of them tall strikers. Could be wrong. I could be wrong. I could easily be wrong. Yeah, he's on the slower side of things, you could say, especially for a Team Season. Um, it, it does seem like a very, very significant boost. We're going to have a look at his, uh, his, both of his cards. His normal card and his new card. Um, as far as the objective itself goes, it looks pretty easy. Um, he's Dutch as well, which is very linkable. Very linkable. So, Saudi scoring. Score using Saudi Pro League players. It's three separate squad battle matches. Pretty easy. Score two goals in two separate squad ball matches. Um, on World Class with four separate weak foot. Pretty easy. This is a free card, man. Assist with a cross and sees three separate squad ball matches. Um, with five Saudi League players, easy, and score an assist in six with Dutch players, super easy. Like this is generally one of the easiest free cards I've ever seen. Uh, let's have a look at his stats. See if he's usable. I don't think he will be very usable. I think he's like six three. I could be wrong again. Um, I don't think he's gonna be very usable since they made him so easy to complete. Everyone's gonna go out and do this. So uh, let's have a look if things would actually load. Tevrede, Tevrede. I think he plays for El Fato. I could be wrong. Again, I'm not I'm not the most knowledgeable knowledgeable about the Saudi League. I'm pretty sure from what I know. Yeah, he's he, I knew he was on the I, I I knew it. I knew it. He was on the solar side. He's plays for um El Fato. Okay, so I was right there. Two star, four star is this card. I expect this to be at least three star skill moves. Thank you. So, two skill moves, four star weak with 6-3. As I said, I'm, I'm correct again, mate. I'm too good. Um, um, I don't think you need me to tell you this, but he's not going to perform well in game for you. You don't need me to tell you. You should you should be able to tell from the 6-3 height and the work rates as well, medium low, not the best. Um, though they're not horrible. Um, yeah, you don't need me to tell you that. He can take a shot. He can score a header. Yeah. Actually, he's got very good short passing, surprisingly. 88 short passing is very good. And he's got very good physicals. Um, the issue isn't with his stats. His stats are brilliant. The issue is with his frame, his body type, and his height. Um, that's where the issue lies. His stats look brilliant from here. Put an anchor. Not an anchor. What am I saying? Put an engine on this, and you've got a very good card. Issue is... His, he's 6'3". His body type is very chunky. I can I can tell you this already. Um, he's got power. Yeah, it's a good header of the ball, but if you're one of those players, hyper meta players, I call them, like me, who use short players like, uh, for example, Mahrez, Neymar, Mbappe, uh, players like that who are quick and nimble. Uh, Messi, Aguero, for example, Werner, another one, Mane, Salah. If you're people who use players like this he's gonna perform horribly for you and you don't need me to say that all right he's basically he's his father he's father hey that's that's it all right i'm sorry if you support alfata he is father he's as father as father can get all right let me know what you guys think about this father um see you guys in a bit peace